Welcome, this is Jaroslav from Model AI and today I will be showing you how to replace landing gears on our Sentinel, M500 and RB5 flight bases. To do this you will need adjustable size wrench, nut driver size 5.5 mm, hex driver size 2 mm, Phillips driver, flush cuts, couple of zip ties, Loctite, landing gear, landing gear mount and hardware that came included with your landing gear kit. Let's pretend this drone has a broken landing gear. To replace it, first you have to remove these four screws. Next, we will be removing the landing gear itself. To do that, first cut the zip tie that is on the bottom side of the drone. To remove the landing gear mount, we will remove these two nuts and screws. You can use the adjustable size wrench or 5.5 mm nut driver. So while holding these two nuts in place, you will reach in with the hex driver from other side and unscrew these two screws. You will also need to remove these two screws which are holding the arms and the landing gear mount. Now you should be able to slide out the landing gear mount. Next you will grab the new landing gear mount, the landing gear itself and included hardware. It should already come pre-assembled but in case you need to do it yourself, here is how you do it. First you take the four nuts and insert them into these four holes. Use a little bit of Loctite on each nut. Depending on which side you are replacing, orient the longer leg towards the back. Take the four screws and put the washers on them. While holding these two nuts down, flip the landing gear, insert the screw with the washer and gently screw it in. After that, tighten the screws tight one by one. Next, we will be attaching the new landing gear to the drone. Make sure that these two spacers are in place. Slide the landing gear in. Make sure not to pinch any ESC wires. Take the long two screws that we removed from here and put a little bit Loctite on them and screw them back into the drone. Take the two hex screws and screw them in from the top.
Take the two lock nuts and put them onto the screw. As a last step, we will need to replace the zip tie that is holding down the ESC cables that run from the ESC itself to the front motors. So this is how you replace the landing gears. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and let us know if you have any questions. Have a great day.